Hello everyone, Frozen Cause here, and welcome back to another episode of Tag Force 4. In the last episode, we began Roman's uh, story, which turns out we, it's me that's just battling everyone, rather than watching someone else duel. So in this episode, we're going to continue the story. Uh, I don't feel very well about this. <laughs> uh, as you saw in the last episode, I did not feel, I don't feel very good literally destroying all my friendships with everyone, you know, because that sucks. But... Yeah. Um. Yeah. Oof. I forgot how sad this story was because I did do the Dark Siner stories when I first played when I first played this game, and I was like, "Damn." All right. All right. Wake up already. I'm here for you, Chorus. Our next target is Jack Atlas. He once ruled the city as the Duel King. He won't be an easy opponent, but using your connection with him to our advantage. There should be plenty of opportunities to take him down. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, great. Well, he's definitely gonna be—he's definitely gonna be a challenge. But uh, I think we think I think I got this, right? I don't know. <laughs> hey there, chorus. I'm here. So, what's so important for you to call me out here and not tell anybody about it? You know, I don't take kindly to being told what to do. If it was anybody but you. Yeah, someone wanted to come with me, but I told them I preferred to fly solo today. So here I am, just like you ordered. Now tell me, what's up? It's a trap. Not much, just a duel. Who's there? Come out, show yourself. You're Dark Signer. So you've come to face me, eh? Okay, you're not my first and definitely won't be my last. Let's do it. Don't get ahead of yourself, Sider. I'm not your opponent. Choruses. What? Do you think you can defeat him? He knows everything about you. <laughs> Chorus, just what kind of joke are you trying to pull here? This isn't a joke. Chorus is serious. This duel may very well be your last. Hm. I asked you to I asked him to help me, and he gladly obliged. But that's impossible. I don't believe you. You expect me to believe that you sided with the Dark Signers? No way! What have you done to him? You must have cast some kind of spell on him or something. Ah, but I told you, he's acting on his own free will. I suppose people have a hard time believing something they don't want to be true, even if it's staring them right in the face. Of course I don't believe it. There's no way that any kind of evil force could come between me, Chorus, and me. We've been through so much together. When I lost the throne, and when I lost Carly, hm, more sentimental foolishness. It seems you're quite popular, huh, Chorus? It makes the sting of betrayal much, that much more potent. <laughs> Do you now see what remains of your bond with Chorus? You can't just brush off the trust we have with words. I'll show you just how strong our friendship is. Right, Chorus? Answer me. Duel. Oh, no. Oh, Jack is definitely going to be one tough cookie. I, and I get the feeling we're going to face off against you, Satan, next. So that's going to be even harder. So I'm not playing any. I'm not playing around anymore. I'm just going to be using my black wings for the rest of the story. I said I wanted to use four different decks, but I was just like, mm, no, let me not. Let me not cause myself any more stress. <laughs> then this duel is already going to cause me. All right. I just need to make sure he doesn't summon Red Dragon Archfiend. Or if he does, I have something to stop him from doing it. That's all. That's all I want. That's all I can do. Two cards face down. Okay. I'm just going to set this. Uh, set this too. And summon Sirocco. No. Okay. No. No Torrential. So that's a plus. I'm just gonna go for Stardust. Just just to prevent him from doing any nonsense. Come on out, Stardust. Alright, so I'm gonna go attack with Cosmic Flare.
Hopefully this works. Ah, he got Mirror Force. No, I don't need to know that. Activate its effect. I knew he had Mirror Force or something. Wait, what? Oh. Okay, never mind. That's nothing. That's not important. Space Gate, that's, that's totally fine. I'm okay with Space Gate. <laughs> uh, yeah, so I'm just gonna bring out Stardust. Bring back Stardust. And that's my turn. Oh boy, okay. Set, he's setting another monster. Alright. Uh, I'm just gonna summon Shara, the blue flame. No. <laughs> no, no, no. Uh, I'm gonna attack this. Oh, Sangin. Alright. He's gonna add a card. Oh no, I didn't mean to do that! Shit! Oh well. Damn it, I did not mean to do that. That's. That was my fault. Destroy Dark Tinker. He gets another Space Gate token. Hmm. Okay. Alright, Jack, bring it on. Fissure? Uh, I'm just gonna use Stardust Ability. Victim Sanctuary. Because no, no, no. I can't have you do that. Frickin' Fissure. Screw that shit. Setting another monster face down. Setting another card. Bring out Stardust. Alright. No. Uh, I'm just gonna set this. Uh, I'm just going to normal summon without tributing. Elf and the Raven. Activate Raven's effect. Uh, put this face up. Oh, Torrential. Man, Stardust is really great at just negating everything. It's a really great card for just stopping shit. Stopping people from destroying monsters and stuff. It's so useful. Alright. What is that? Oh, it's Powered Tuner. Okay. Uh, come on, Shura. Let's attack this guy. Another Space Gate token. Activate Shura's effect. Uh... I guess I'll bring out... Minstrel? In defense position. And attack with Elfin. Get out of here. No damage so far, which I'm kind of happy about. <laughs> uh, Synchro Summon. Into uh, Armed Wing. Because I like Blacking Armed Wing. Bring out Armed Wing. And end my turn. And bring back Stardust. And don't use Torrent Tribute. <laughs> Alright, Jack, show me what you got. I don't think he has anything for me. <laughs> nah, not a. He can't stop me because of Stardust. Uh. No, let's just attack. Let's go Armed Wing. Attack that face down. That turns at 2800. Boop. His Space Gate goes again. What is he trying to do with Space Gate? It, it doesn't seem like it's doing anything much of him. But with that, we're probably we're, we're, we're going to win after this. Thank God for no Battle Fader, because that doesn't become a thing until Tag Force 5. So I'm glad there's no such thing as that yet. Or Swift Scarecrow. Lord have mercy. Alright. You know, I was worried about nothing. 
Black wings are very powerful. Oh, man. That was not so bad. And not as bad as I thought it was going to be, honestly. Alright. Chorus, your duel felt so familiar. I suppose you were my... our friend. I guess it isn't weird that it did. Ugh. I once betrayed my friends too. Now I'm being the one betrayed. I understand how they must have felt. That feeling of being betrayed by somebody that's closer to you than family. Now I know how bad it hurts. Chorus, even if you weren't a signer, to us you... No, to me, you were a friend I couldn't live without. I truly believe that. Until now. Urgh. From this moment on, you are my enemy. I will rid myself of the humiliation you've caused me today. Mark my words, I will. Damn. <laughs> Even the man who was once hailed as the Duel King can't stand the pain in his heart. This has been too easy. Excellent work. You've done better than I could have ever imagined. Now there's only one signer that remains. The day the world will be enveloped in darkness is drawing closer. Let's meet again soon. I'll contact you again when the time is right. Oh man. That definitely hurt. Because, I mean, as much as Jack is an asshole, I kind of like him. Oh man. Anyways, I'm going to go look for Roman, Roman again, and I'll see you at the next story. Okay, got Roman up to his last heart, so let's uh, begin the last story. Last story of this whole Let's Play too. So uh, yeah, let's get this started. Time to wake up, Chorus. The time has come. The time for you say to join his friends in defeat and despair. Such is the destiny of the signers. Don't hold anything back. Fight him with everything you've got. Show him the world as it will be reborn. It's almost time for us to meet him. Let's go. Oh, uh, no. Well, here comes the greatest challenge you're going to have. Oof. Okay, let's do this. Hey, Chorus. I came just like you asked. A uh, Dark Signer? <laughs> I knew it. You're not surprised to see me. I figured you would be here. Oh? All my friends have been acting strange recently. Luna is sick and has been sleeping for days. Akiza has run off somewhere. Nobody knows where she is. I've only spoken to Jack directly, but he refuses to give me any details about what happened. I just, I had just about given up when was, and was about to head home when I realized Jack's body was covered in cuts and bruises that he could only have gotten from a duel. Hmm, but you don't think the injuries were from a duel with a dark signer, and that he was too ashamed to talk about such a humiliating loss. I guess you didn't think of it that way? No, it can't be it. Jack wouldn't be like that if he'd simply lost a duel. His physical injuries are not the problem. I myself lost a Kallen in the past, so I know how it feels to be that, to be scarred like that. Eh, that's true. Their real injuries they've sustained are the ones to their hearts. Hmm. The mark on my arm didn't inform me that my friends were fighting a dark signer either. With that in mind, the only duelist I know that Jack, that could beat Jack is... Oh. You, Chorus. A impressive detective work, Fudo. But in spite of that, the fact that I've come here means I've I had some doubt. I hope my suspicions were wrong. Chorus, why are you doing this? We're supposed to be friends. Oh no. Heh, <laughs> you're wasting your time. Chorus has opened the door to the underworld of his own free will. No! Why are you doing why are you using Chorus this way? Do you want to know why I chose him? The reason is quite simple. He's one of the rare people that was close to all of you, and strong enough to face you all in a duel. That's why I sought him to join my side. Honestly, I was a little surprised when he accepted my offer so readily. Surely, Chorus must have 
already tapped into the darkness within him. That's not true. <laughs> Chorus, it's not too late. We won't judge you for what you've done. The Dark Signs are trying to destroy this world. Don't help them do it. All of your friends before you have already tried, but his heart is beyond your call. Fine, then I'll win him back with a duel. Duel me, Chorus. <laughs> that was Chorus's plan from the start. I'll make you remember the bond you had with us all. Duel! Aw, oh, no. Can I really do this? Can I really beat you, say? I don't know. Depends on his... Depend on... It depends on his deck. <laughs> Honestly. Alright. Oh boy, here it comes. Prepare for a lot of stinging. Is what I would say, but this hand is perfect. What? Excuse me? This hand is perfect. This hand is pretty dope. Alright. Let's just see what he does. Alright, you say. Let's see what you can do. Of course, he starts off with Max Warrior. That's not a surprise. Oh! Oh, turret warrior. Okay, I can pick up what you're putting down. Nah, I'll let him attack me. I'll, I'll let him attack. Oh, he has nothing. Okay. Uh, I'm just gonna... Swiggity swiggity, I'm gonna yoink your turret warrior. Give me that. Whoop! <laughs> That's mine. And I'm going to summon Shura the Blue Flame. And special summon Gale the Whirlwind. And I'm going to attack. Nope. I'm not using Icarus attack yet. Oh man. Wow, that was easy. That was easy so far. Wow, he must have just had monsters in his hand. That's the only explanation I can think of. Because normally he would have some sort of spell or trap ready at the ready. Uh, I'm going to use that turret warrior and special summon Stardust. I'm going to destroy him with his own monster. <laughs> I'm about to end this man's whole career. <laughs> oh, lord. Here comes Stardust, and I'm going to end my turn. Man. Alright, so I know for a fact he's probably going to have... He's going to draw Mirror Force or Monster Reborn. Whichever one. It doesn't matter. Oh, tuning. Okay. Okay. That's, uh... He's gonna bring out Junk Synchron. I saw Level Eater down there. Oh, he's setting. Okay. Ah, Swords of Revealing Light. Of course. That's it? Oh, psh, okay. Uh. I'm just gonna summon this. And special summon Blackwing Gale. And I'm gonna use Icarus Attack to tribute Minstrel. One, two. Not gonna use Stardust Effect. I'm just gonna attack with Shora. And I'm gonna end him with his own card. I don't do that often. <laughs> that was so easy. As I said before, black wings are pretty damn broken. And that's game. Oof. This whole this whole story has left a bad taste in my mouth. Not gonna lie. Oh no. Am am I am I an asshole? <laughs> oh man. Ugh, 
course. You're pathetic, you say. Where is all your confidence now? Don't you understand? It was your destiny to lose here today. Chorus, even now, you're still our... Uh, our friend. Aw. Aw, no. I feel terrible. <laughs> We've done it. All of the signers have been defeated. Good job, Chorus. You didn't disappoint. You're an even better duelist than I had anticipated. Uh, I feel terrible. Now, what do we... Now, what to do from here? Are you satisfied? I believe that your desire to duel against strong opponents has been fulfilled. You fought the Sinus to satisfy a thirst deep within you, didn't you? What? It's up to me? So if I tell you to continue to duel, you'll do so? I see. It seems like you have a rather deep relationship with Callan. Carly, Misty, and Divac, too. <laughs> I thought so. That's very good. Well, with the signers now defeated, I have no value as a dark signer anymore. And I'm not the right kind of person for you to be with. Don't you think so? I see. That's up to me too, eh? I think the type of person that's best for you to be around is... Wait. Let's talk about this after we finish our next job. Shall we go, Chorus? Yes, our next target is... <laughs> oh, man, this guy's pure evil. Anyways, so with that, we've done it. We've done all the main character story arcs. And uh, we've got Earthbound Immortal Uru, which is the same thing with all the other Earthbound Immortals, except once per turn, you contribute one monster, except this card, to select and take control of one face up monster your opponent controls until the end phase. So uh, that's pretty interesting. That fits Rome, Roman's deck style. Alright, so that is it. We've done all the main character stories and Tag Force. And now we can just play Let the Credits Roll. So with that, I'm going to get out of here. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this whole Let's Play, uh, please leave a like, comment, maybe subscribe already, and I'll see you guys at the next project we do. Uh, which will probably be coming very soon. Probably next week. So uh, yeah, thank you so much for watching, and enjoy the credits.